On June 2, 2014, Cincinnati Bengals defensive tackler Devin Still was going to his four-year-old daughter Leah's dance recital. Before going to the recital, she was complaining of pain in her leg and she had a fever. They took her to the hospital where she was later diagnosed with stage 4 neuroplasma and was given a 50% chance of survival. The very next day, Still called the Bengals organization to explain to them what was going on and asked for some time off to be with his daughter during this difficult time. He then went to his fans by posting an announcement on Instagram and letting them know what was going on with his family. The outpouring of well wishes for the still family was instantaneous. Twitter and Instagram blew up with people showing their love for both Devin and Leah and wishing for a speedy recovery. Due to the high cost of treatment for Leah, Devin was forced to go back to training camp. In late August, he was cut from the team, but they offered him a spot on the practice squad so he could keep his insurance. Then, on September 4th, he was signed on to the 53-man active roster. Twitter was inundated with fans, both of the Bengals and non-fans, amazed by this outpouring. The Bengals also stated that all proceeds from the still number 75 jersey would go to the Cincinnati Children's Hospital to support pediatric cancer research. That weekend alone, over 5,000 jerseys were sold. To this date, over $1.53 million has been raised. On September 25th, Lee was going to have surgery to get the tumor, lymph nodes, and right adrenal gland where it all started from removed. Devin went on Instagram again to post the pep talk heard around the world. He said, you ready to get this cancer up out of you? She said, yes. They did a little fist pump. Throughout this whole event, Devin still has used Instagram and Twitter to keep everyone up to date on how Leah is doing. It has brought a cancer not known widely to the national spotlight. Social media has helped. Through this whole event, Devin still has used Instagram and Twitter to keep everyone up to date on how Leah is doing. It has brought a cancer not known widely to a national spotlight. Social media has helped to raise millions of dollars for research for a cure for this and other cancers. By using social media, Devin has found a way to keep us all aware of pediatric cancer and to thank everyone for their support.